Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new here, you are welcome. Is it recording? I guess it's recording. It just seems so weird. Let's see, what does fear have for you today, guys? What energies are surrounding you? What do you need to pay attention to? Love, life, finance, everything, guys. <clears throat> If you are new here, guys, anything you need to know about me is down in the description box. How to get a reading, how to follow me on the socials, you know, all of those things. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Ooh, Spirit said take it. Angelic protection, guys. You are definitely protected right now. Whatever's going on with you, you are protected. You have your angels around you. There's also compassion. I don't know if this calls for compassion. Maybe you need to be more compassionate towards someone. These cards sound silky. Silky, baby. And then there's some vulnerability and some freedom here going on. So you're feeling vulnerable, but you're, you're also feeling very free. All right. You have compassion for someone. Feeling vulnerable. And this could be a holy love, guys. This could be a holy love. Let's go with it. Maybe this connection is protected. Maybe you need to have compassion for someone. You know, maybe you got to be a little more vulnerable. Step into someone else's shoes. Spirit said this is a holy love. Maybe some things went down, right? But you need to have the biggest part that sticks out to me is compassion. And then vulnerability. You're going to have to be vulnerable towards someone with compassion in order to set yourself free, right? <clears throat> but it's, it's a holy love, so let's see what's going on. Uh, king of Wands. Okay, so a King of Wands is going to have to be... A King of Wands is going to have to be... They're going to have to use compassion. <clears throat> Regardless of whatever step this person chooses to take, they are protected by their angels. But they're going to have to have compassion towards someone else. And they're going to have to feel vulnerable in order to set themselves free. So it looks like this King of Wands here wants to renege <laughs> on a proposal because it's a Knight of Cups in reverse. So it's almost like they want to pull their love back. They want to be like, look, you know, for whatever reason, I need to rescind this offer. They were also in their Knight of Wands energy, so they were probably busy with other people. <clears throat> so I guess when they bring this message to you or you them, they're gonna have to do it with compassion or they will do it with com compassion. So a King of Wands is about to deliver a, a stern message to someone about moving on. They could have been, they're gonna tell them they could have been cheating because they're in their Knight of Wands energy, but this, this King of Wands here who was in their Knight of Wands energy, they're ready to move on. They're in their page of wands energy. They're eager. They're happy. They're loyal. Like, they're just ready. They're ready to move forward. And they are. They're ready to move forward to this holy love here. And they're in their eight of cups. So, they're definitely walking away. So, this king of wands here is saying a goodbye. But they're going to have to do it with compassion. And vulnerability. Like, they themselves have to be vulnerable as well. In order to set yourself free. Sometimes, guys, you have to step out on faith. Because I know... You get in relationships and then you're comfortable. Sometimes you're even married to it. You could be, you could have been dating somebody for 10 years, married for 10 years, together for 20 years. And people think sometimes, oh, we've been together for so long, but you could have been miserable for so long as well. And people don't understand, well, why did you walk away? Y'all been together for 15 years and he's such a good person and she's such a good person. Well, yeah, you didn't live with it every day. You didn't sleep with it every day. You didn't talk to it every day. Y'all didn't pay bills together. Y'all didn't see who was bringing what to the table, who was bringing in 70, 30, who was bringing in 30, 70, who was bringing in 99 and 1%. Like, no one will ever really know the reason why someone left the relationship except for those two people. But I tell you this. When people do leave, they've tried all options to stay. They probably put up with so much. They probably forgave so much. They probably cried so much. They probably lost so much. People forget that even though you walk away, sometimes you walking away was by the skin of your teeth. 
Had you stayed a little longer, you would have lost it all, right? Had you stayed a little longer, you would have died. Had you stayed a little longer, like whatever. People don't know why you leave, except for the two people that's in that relationship, guys. I say leave. If you're in a relationship and you just got to break it down to somebody, look, I'm miserable up in this bitch, tell them. I'm unhappy. Tell them. And you know how they be crying and you talking about, well, I want you to stay, I want you to stay. Then put the tears on them and be like, but I really want to leave. I'm really unhappy here. Turn that shit back on them. When they start crying to you about why they need you, you start crying to them about why you need to leave. Period. People don't understand because sometimes the people that leave, you, you put yourself through so much. You probably allowed so much that it took strength to get you to leave. It took strength. That's why this person has to be vulnerable. Sometimes you think you're going to lose it all. You're going to lose your house, your car. You're going to lose the two incomes. You're going to lose this. You're going to lose that. The person you're going to, it may not even work out. You do da, 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 da. Guess what? Doesn't matter. Because where you at right now, you're not happy. Period. So either stay there, be unhappy, or go take a freaking chance. This person is about to take a chance. They're about to go take a chance. I say do it. Do it. Yep, they're walking away from something or someone from their past. It's the Six of Cups in reverse. They're in their Page of Swords energy. They're in temperance as well. They want this victory. This person is trying to move forward. They don't want what's currently being offered to them right now. It's like, that's not enough anymore. Like, that's not enough. They've been keeping their eye on you or you, them, right? Feel free to flip these energies. They're a hangman over this breakup, though. Yep, King of Pentacles in reverse. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. And it's just too many burdens. That whole situation is just too many burdens. They could have lost money, everything. Anything final spirit? Somebody's being vulnerable and setting themselves free. You may not be in com communications with this person right now. I don't know if you walked away from them. But they chose wrong. This person chose wrong. They chose a lack of love. They got to something. They chose something. And then when they got it, it didn't even fulfill them emotionally. So now they're turning their back on that because it ended up being nothing, right? It wasn't their emotional fulfillment. And here they are fighting, fighting to be free again. Trying to get to their chariot. They're in their chariot, but they haven't made any moves. But they're not going to hold themselves back, right? They want this lovers here. It's a fool card in reverse. They don't want to go back to what they had, right? This person, right now, they're kind of be, they're in a reckless energy because look, they said nothing's going to stop me um, from getting to this person that they love. So they're in a reckless energy right now. They don't even care. They want this two of cups with you. There's the devil there. They have a lot of passion for you guys. And seven of cups in reverse, there's no one else that they want. There's no one else that they want. They know they want you. It's like they have to heal themselves because they're having a hard time getting to you. They see you as being single. They're following their intuition. And they just, all they do is think about you. They just think you're a loving person. You're where they want to be. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, they know they have to end this partnership here. They have to end something. And that's going to start their big fight, if not already. They could be fighting it because they could have been dealing with the Page of Pentacles in reverse. Somebody who's not loyal, right? Maybe they just wasn't. Mm. Could have been dealing with a childish person. Someone who wasn't loyal. This person wants love. They're all up in their head, guys. They want this Ten of Cups. All they keep thinking about is this love and this Ten of Cups. They want that holy love. Anything else for you? Anything final? 
They don't know if you're gonna accept this love. They they want this rebirth. And they're gonna follow their intuition, guys. They are, they're making a decision for themselves. Good for you, guys. Go be vulnerable. Set yourself free. This person is going to be vulnerable and set themselves free for the love of their lives. Good, make your decision. They didn't work well. They're gonna get judged because somebody's gonna feel stabbed in the back. So they're worried, they're worried about being judged, right? They worry about being judged if they walk away. Yep, from this four of wands here. Four of wands in reverse, world card in reverse. King of cups in reverse. And that they're gonna move on and that they're gonna offer their love. They're gonna put it in the work somewhere else. So this person, although they, they feel vulnerable, they're gonna set themselves free. They have to be vulnerable in order to be free, but they're gonna get judged by other people, but they don't care. They're gonna get judged. Yep, they're gonna get judged because they're walking away from a baby's mom. And that's all it was. Whatever, she'll heal. Spirit says she'll heal right there. Mm -hmm. She'll heal. They figured that he's leaving the baby's mom for Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, this person, the Hierophant's in reverse. This person, they don't have any regrets. They don't have any regrets, none. Good for you. They don't have no regrets. Yeah, they're going to be vulnerable and set themselves free, but they're going to be judged. Yeah, this was karma. Will of Fortune in reverse. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Six of Pentacles in reverse. Queen of Wands upright. This person is walking away. It was unbalanced. It was unbalanced. It was unbalanced. And just because they have a child together doesn't mean stay together. Period. Amen, guys. Thanks for watching. I don't even know if it's still recording because it said low, whatever. I hope it's still recording. I hope y'all got it. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.